Okay, folks, this will be an interesting one. They look really nice. Uh, they're a bit mouldy, though. They smell mouldy. Um, they're an interesting piece, even though they're boring. You do something interesting with it, I'm sure. Okay, let's see what these are. I can't put them on the bed because they're mouldy. This is what they are, a pair of pyjama pants um, from an airline. Uh, an airline, uh, you can see there, upside down, it's Qantas. It's a Qantas pants, 100% cotton. So if I can, de if I can remove the mould from these, these will make really nice pyjama pants to sleep in. Uh, but they're obviously for aircraft intended for a um, person travelling on Qantas Airways. Obviously for someone maybe going for a long haul flight, perhaps. I don't know where people get changed in an aircraft. Unless there's a luxury, unless they're in a luxury uh, play, uh, play, uh, unless, unless they're on a luxury flight where they get a change room or something. Uh, available for them to use because otherwise you just don't know how you'd, you'd get changed on an aircraft I've never been on a I haven't been on a long haul flight for a long for a long time I don't I've never been to New York or anywhere like that where you're on a plane for that amount of time I, I haven't had the privilege of being able to do that kind of travel folks <laughs> I did some stupid things in my youth and because I did stupid things I missed out on on all sorts of things including travel and I haven't been overseas since 1988 and it's now 2024 so it's been a long time since I went on anything that even resembles a fucking holiday uh, I'm not rich I don't I'm disabled so I don't have the opportunities that so-called normal people have. Uh, I really miss my partner Luigi and I'd like to travel with him. I don't want to be on my own anymore. I can't afford to travel overseas and I can't travel because I have problems with navigating my memories really badly shot. I have a shot memory so I can't remember people telling what people say when they're giving me directions i'm gonna put this on the floor it needs to be fucking um have the mold treated if i'm gonna use it but yeah i've never had the opportunity to travel except when i was i could have traveled with luigi when i was young i could have got married to him and we could have gone overseas and done all sorts of cool things this is what happens folks when you make mistakes in life Sometimes your life is just totally upended. And you don't even know what your potential is. You don't know what your life could have been if you had done it this way instead of that way. And I'm really angry at myself. So I haven't had the opportunity to go to places like New York, to go on real adventures. And I haven't even travelled much in, in Australia. I've travelled to Adelaide once. I've been to Melbourne a few times. I've been to Brisbane. Brisbane's the most visited place. I've been to Cairns. I used to live in Cairns when I was a young one, when I was really, really young. But I haven't been much else. I've been to some small regional places like Newcastle and Gosford 
Adelong Falls. Yeah, I've been to places, but not, not a great deal. Uh, I haven't been to... I, yeah, it's just really sad that I missed out on all these wonderful opportunities that I could have had because I fucked up. So, I'm not rich. I can't afford to have someone come with me to help me with uh, things like directions and that. This has come up looking interesting, folks. So I'm trying to get on the 6 o'clock news as a talented photocopier artist. I'm trying to get in touch with my partner Luigi, who I'd like to travel with. He'd make the best companion to travel with. I don't have any friends. I don't have a social life. I, I do have people helping me with cooking and cleaning and decluttering and shit, but I don't have help. I don't have a friend, an actual friend, as opposed to a disability worker or an NDIS or, a, or any other kind of worker. So, you know, I really I haven't got access to a friend. Friendship is indeed a luxury. For me, it's a luxury, folks, that I don't have. Don't take it for granted, folks, that you have relationships, you know, if you really love someone. I've been with some horrible men. I've been sexually abused because I wasn't with Luigi. So, yeah. You make mistakes, folks, you end up paying for them. And sometimes people, most of the time, people don't realise they've made mistakes. For me, it's glaringly obvious what I've done wrong. And I really regret it. And I'm sorry, but sorry doesn't fix everything, folks. Being, having, I have to somehow forgive myself, but I just can't. Can't forgive myself, folks, until I get on the six o'clock news. I can't put the ghosts of the past behind me, folks. And that's come up looking really quite interesting. I think we can now call this demo quits.